Hey, little girl. Where's your mummy and daddy? Don't patronize me, mister. I'm older than I look, and probably always will be, especially when I'm rich and famous, and can afford all those facelifts. Well, nice to meet a fellow Australian, here at Wolverhampton Municipal Library, and a fellow ambitious Australian at that. What's your name, Sheila? You mean apart from Sheila? Yeah, that's right. Does it really matter? Not really, since I will know you as Sheila, along with all the other Sheilas, that just seem to merge into one big undifferentiated mass, to us average Aussie males. Well it's Kylie Kylie Minog, and I guess, being probably the only Australians in Wolverhampton, that makes us neighbours. That's the great thing about being Australian, we're always neighbours, home and away. Well, little Sheila, maybe one day you'll grow up, to be a great all-round entertainer, like me. Can you paint? No I can't, but it's never held you back. Can you sing? No, but that hasn't held you back either. That's right little Sheila, that's the great thing about Britain. This is a country that's so lost the plot, that the young generation regarded as with it, and burnt out media hacks low in Brit, upper class twit faced public school boys, to run the arts and entertainment industry, and people really believe that flock wall paper and wall to wall carpeting spell luxury. It means utterly talentless Aussie trash like ourselves can make it big. No particular charm, charisma, or accomplishment required. We have nothing to offer, and Great British TV will let us offer it night after night until the nation's nose starts to bleed. I love this country, Sheila. Kylie, 